you know, I, I'm fascinated by these questions of, of astrobiology. And, you know, the, the, the most compelling thing to me about it is that basically everywhere on Earth we've looked for life, we found life, you know, under frigid Antarctic uh, lakes. We've found them in hazardous waste tanks. We found them in, in oil and in, in liquid hard hydrocarbons on Earth. So it seems like anywhere life can exist, it does exist. And so then the question becomes, what are the extremes of that? And, you know, if a place like Titan could have life, I imagine that, yeah, it, it probably doesn't look anything like life on Earth. So that's... Uh, that's a pretty exciting, exciting future to think about. It really is. And when you when you look at the fact that the collections, for example, that we hear, hold here at the National Museum of Natural History, you know, we hold this fossil record going going back to the origins of life. And, and we know from those collections that life evolved very rapidly here on Earth once conditions stabilized. So within about 500 million years of the Earth forming, we know life existed. And so the fact that it formed so kind of easily here on yeah. Earth makes us really optimistic that with similar conditions, it could have evolved elsewhere, a place like Mars, for example.